What are malware and ransomware? This video will define malware, define ransomware, and outline how ransomware can affect councils. The term malware combines the words malicious and software. It refers to any software that is designed to cause harm. Ransomware is a specific type of malware that is designed to prevent organisations from accessing their computer systems and data. Perpetrators of ransomware attacks will use this lack of access as leverage to demand some kind of ransom, usually a payment. Importantly, perpetrators may or may not restore access to systems and data upon getting paid. Councils should not consider paying a ransom. It is against the central government and UK law enforcement's policy. The act may be found to be illegal if it is related to terrorist and other criminal activity. Paying will make an organisation more likely to be targeted. Sectors that are known to pay have seen a spike in ransomware attacks. Malware and ransomware can cause serious harm to council assets and operations. Let's take, for example, a council officer who opens a suspicious email attachment that allows ransomware to get onto the council's IT system. The ransomware encrypts the council's data and data backups, rendering them unintelligible. This causes council officers' computers to become unusable. The attackers demand a large sum of money to restore the data, but the council refuses to pay because there is no guarantee that the data will be restored after payment. It takes the council many months to recover from the attack, and the cost of restoring systems reaches into the millions, hurting its ability to deliver core business services to its citizens. Let's round off the video with two things your council can do to protect itself. To lower the likelihood of falling victim, it is important to use mail and website filtering tools. Your council may also want to consider using enterprise antivirus or anti-malware products that protect council servers and end-user devices together, rather than standard antivirus software which protects end-user devices on an individual basis. Finally, it is important to talk to IT colleagues to learn more about security and mitigations your council has in place to protect itself. This video is part of a series designed to expand your understanding of digital, technology and cyber security concepts. To learn more about the terms we covered, please watch our other videos.